Hey guys, it's about 4.30 in the evening right now. I'm gonna head out and do some dumpster diving and today I'm gonna show you kind of like a vlog style of dumpster diving. I'm gonna show you the reality of dumpster diving. Sometimes you score, sometimes you don't. So let's see what we find on this Sunday evening. So right now I'm at a Beals or Bells, however you pronounce that. We're gonna see if there's anything in here. And no, it's like personal trash. I was a little hopeful just because of all these boxes, but there's nothing. So on to the next one. Okay, next up is a Bath and Body Works. I think of something right here. Stinks in here. So a single wick candle down there. Hold on. Let me grab her. Got it. Sun drenched linen. All right, next is Ulta. Oh, that's never a good sign. Dumpster divers, quick tip, never leave a mess. This is what's gonna ruin it for everybody. All right, it looks like we have some display boards in here today. Lots of display boards. It's hard to tell, there's so much is in here. Now it's time for Burlington. We have some hangers. And I don't know, we'll see. No, I was here yesterday. It looks exactly the same. At my local five below, this isn't a good sign. Looks like they're getting a compactor. They are connected to an Aldi's, so hopefully it's for Aldi's instead. I think we have a, might, a grab bag from Five Below. One. I think we have another two grab bags from Five Below. And a third. Now I'm at the pet store. Right off the back, this really nice fish tank. It's in there. So I'm gonna take that. I don't know if it's broken, but look at that. That's cool, it's like two sides. Down here, so we have foods, all kinds of foods. Next up is Barnes and Nobles. I couldn't tell what was in this bag, so we're gonna look. Uh, might be just be trash, might not be. We'll see. Uh, it's trash. Don't ever find anything here anymore. I'm home now. It is now 5.50, I think. So we went to about six to seven different stores. And I actually did pretty well today. I was thinking I wasn't gonna find anything, but I did pretty decent for only, for an hour's worth of diving. So let's get started. Um, so these are five below. I, I call them mystery bags, but we'll go through those in a second. Oh, this one's ripping. Um, I know you guys, oh, d darn it. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I think it's a good thing that I know how to fix broken candles. All right, so I did find this single wick candle from Bath and Body Works. It's sun drenched linen. It was perfectly fine, but I just accidentally broke it. I have to clean that up. All right, so let me be careful with this other bag. We have stapled bag. And oh, actually, I don't think it's candles. It's a whole bunch of testers of the fragrance butterfly, I guess. It's not very full, but we have a spray. I just want to smell it. Oh, that actually smells good. That's that's so weird. It's all the same. Must have threw away a whole display. This is the body butter. I think I found this before. And it's got like a few digs in it. Not bad. 
We have the butterfly hand soap, the Try Me sticker on everything. So they were definitely testers. And then we have the, uh, what is this one? The body cream, still full. All right, so not a candle, but a whole line of body care, not bad. And I broke this candle, I'm gonna have to fix it. Um, so we're, while we're down here, let's open this um, fish tank I found at the pet store. See if it's unbroken. I think I hear something though, so let's see. Still has all the packaging in it. Doesn't even look like it was ever touched. Yeah, oh, it's broken. But you know what? You can still use the lights that come with it and the filter. So it's kind of like a win-win. You get to use uh, parts that maybe you can use for a different fish tank because it still has like all the little extra mechanisms you will need for a fish tank. So we can still use all the other pieces, the filters, the little LED lights, we can still use them. That's unfortunate, but hey, it happens. All right, let's go through the first five below grab bag and see if we found anything. Um, I showed you a compactor. I hope it's not for the five below. I'm hoping it's for the grocery store that's right next to it. So we'll find out. We have some kind of a Halloween mask. I think it lights up. That's fun. We'll try that out. And don't mind my hands. I was tie-dyeing for my daughter's um, Halloween week at school, so my hands are stained. Look at these really comfy dinosaur socks. Yes. Trash. Trash. Um, waving guy? What the? Is this like one of these? I think I've seen these on TikTok. It's like one of those, you know, car dealerships have those big floaties that like dance and do crazy things. Does it need a battery? I think it needs batteries, but yeah, we'll test him out in a little bit. Um, something, some controllers. They're in there. Car mounds, always find those at Five Below. Headband. Cute little gift bags. Definitely gonna reuse those. We have just some squishy balls. I think we have another one of these little desktop waving guys. So we'll see if they both work. Cool, we have a whole thing of smaller gift bags. Always nice to have because when you buy somebody a gift last minute, you forget about the bag. So it's always fun to have those from dumpster diving. Um, we have a type C cable charger. Oh, they cut it, look at that. They cut it. Empty. Something for a watch. Let's see if it's in there. It's in there. It's just like a protective thing for an Apple Watch, I guess. Incense, um, chocolate milk. I don't know if that would be good, <laughs> ew. But we'll see. What is this? Nag jump? Well, I don't even know what this is. Oh, okay. These are more incense. They're like the little triangle ones. They smell like incense. They don't have like a certain... Disgusting, I'll be throwing this right away. Fart spray. Disgusting. <laughs> My kids are excited. They're like hovering over me. Um, over there in the yard, please. Oh, yes. Go over there in the yard and do it. Not over here by me. Oh, I'm not spraying that. I don't want to smell that. Um, lots of perfume boxes. They probably were just putting out new testers. Uh, sound active, cool. LED lights, it looks like it's red maybe. They're in there, hasn't been cut. And I think it's just red, so. I think we have more. We have some pink ones. I'm gonna open it up just to see if they cut them because it's weird. They, some things they destroy, other things they don't. These definitely look like they were probably returned because they're not in packaging. But then again, I don't know. So I'll test them out. We have another little watch wristband, but this one's like a black one. Uh, what is this? Tiny little deodorant without a lid. A little squishy ball. More of these neon lights. A huge calculator. Fun. It works. Um, we have some uh, essential oil. 
more of these incense. What's this? More incense. Um, I don't think this tobacco. I don't know. I don't know. I don't really burn incense, but I don't ever buy them. So I guess at least since I have them, I'll try them. Here's some more dragon blood. To me, they, to me, they all just smell the same. And then I think we have some broken cups. Second bag, I see some cut wires peeking through. So let's see. Basketball hoop. They cut all these. Awesome tissue paper to go along with the bags I found from the first bag. Nothing in there. Uh, we have one of these like sprinkle things or what do they call them? Spark sprinklers for the hose to play with. This one looks like it lights up. We have some slip on shoes. I mean, they're not bad for $5, like quick little shoes. They're a medium, it says. Um, not bad. We have a five below bag, the reusable bags, but they cut the, maybe just broke, I don't know. Sw one swimming shoe, let's see if there's another one, cause I'll just donate the shoes. Oh, we have one of these squishy eggs. Ew. <laughs> My daughter loves those. I'll disinfect them and then give them to her. Um, earbuds, they're in there. Oh, cool. Um, hubcat, you know, not hubcaps, like tire plugs, but these ones light up. There's one in there. I don't know if somebody stole them or something. This isn't a new thing. I remember people had these back when I was young on their car back in the like pimp my ride times so yeah we have a rug love finding these um cute my son's actually riding his bike right now um and this is what they do so i'm gonna see if it actually fits on his bike wheel i don't know we'll see we have a first aid kit always nice to have i just keep them in my car we'll use that we have um one fighting glove i don't know i think I think this you like shoot. Another pack of incense, good vibes. Quite a few. Top of a lid, what is this? We have a mask, ooh, it's like a bloody mask, cool. Halloween's tomorrow, so these little things are fun to have. Um, we have another pack of LED light strips. I don't know, like a case. Okay, and that's going to, oh, there's something in here. I'm not sure what that is. It's, it's a sand leaking, one of these little toys. Here's the third and last bag. Let's see if there's anything we can use in here. All right, what is this? What is this? It's dirty, that's what it is. But let's see what it actually is. I think it's a hamper. I'm do this with one hand. All right, you put that down. All right, so it's just a hamper. It's got something on it, but it's still intact. That's cool. I'm gonna use it just to put everything in it, bring it in the house. <laughs> um, these were one of these crates you can build. I've seen them before. I'm not sure if it's broken, but I'll try it again later. What is all this stuff? trash um this is one of those door hangers or whatever this thing this um oh this is useful these go on the back of like your um seats in the car so your kids can have like coloring books or whatever in the back we have a blanket love finding blankets and stuff i just usually donate them to the pet store we have another one of these organizer things. Okay, cute little case, it's broken. Oh, okay, I just, the lid was in the other bag. So we actually have a, like a tumbler cup. The lid was in the other bag. It's like a studded, kind of reminds me of the Starbucks ones. 
cut cord, a whole bunch of chalk, earbuds, they're in there, charger, we have a poor little broken skelly hand, some dirty leggings, a dirty kitty cat, some socks, uh -oh, an aromatherapy thing, an aromatherapy, um, essential oil thing. A skull cup. One of these weird gadgets. Another little squishy. Mike and Dyke candies. More squishies. Just a whole bunch of trash in the last bag. I've cut goggles and stuff. Um, sorry about that, my phone died but I'm going through everything right now sorting through what's savable and what's not and then the last thing I was trying to show you before my phone cut off was this Michael Myers like ski mask type situation and then I thought this was a Game Boy but they must be selling their own little version it's like tech solutions all right so I'm gonna go through and pick out the trash not a bad hour dumpster diving score so guys this isn't an everyday thing. I got lucky with wanting to show you an everyday reality dive situation and I actually got lucky. And you guys were able to see that some days you do score and some days you don't. I think I will do random little videos like this here and there just to show you that not every day is score, score, score. And that's why I only put out a video like every week or every two weeks is because there's some days, five days in a row, I will find nothing. And then, you know, on the sixth day, I'll find one thing. On the next day, I'll find two things. You know, it's 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 just a big um, collection that I put together for one video. It's not a score of one day. Just know if you don't find anything, just stay consistent, stay at it. Once you get into a routine, you'll kind of figure out like what days they throw out or they might not at all. You just, if you stay consistent and go around the same time, you will eventually find something. It's not easy. It's something you have to work at. But let me know down in the comments if you guys have any tricks or tips. Uh, I've just been doing it for so long that I think I just got the hang of it. And don't get me wrong, people get to it before me all the time. First come, first serve. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.